Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we will learn, how to crop image before uploading of image, by using jQuery Croppy plugin, and then after how to upload crop image using Ajax in Laravel 6 framework. We have already published many video tutorial on, upload image using Ajax in Laravel framework, but there are some viewer has requested us to, publish video tutorial on, how to crop and upload image in Laravel 6 framework. Here we will use jQuery Croppy plugin for crop image, so when we have select image from our local computer, then this will crop an image in circle shape, or in square shape. Now we have discussing this topic, so this is our Laravel 6 working folder, first we want to make controller for handle HTTP request. For this we have go to command prompt, and here we have first go to our Laravel working folder directory. Now we have write this command, and run this command, it will make image crop controller class in app directory controller folder. Under this controller class, first we have make index method, this is root method of this controller class. Under this method, we have write return statement with view method, and under this, we have write view file name image crop, it will load this view file in browser. Now we have go to resources directory, and open views folder, here we have already created image crop.blade.php file. Here we have already included bootstrap library file, jQuery library file and croppy plugin library file, which we have store under this Laravel framework public directory. Under this file, first we have write at the rate csrf Laravel expression, this is for prevent from cross-site request forgery attacks. Here first we have write division tag, with id is equal to image preview, under this tag, this croppy plugin will display selected image preview for crop. After this for select image from local computer, here we have write input type is equal to file, name and id is equal to upload image. Now we want to make button for crop and upload image, so here we have write button tag, with class is equal to crop image, by click on this button image will be crop, and upload into crop image folder of Laravel framework public directory. For display crop and uploaded image from crop image folder, here we have write division tag, with ID is equal to uploaded image. Now we have moved to write jQuery code for initialize croppy plugin, so here we have write dollar image crop variable is equal to dollar with division tag ID image preview with croppy method. This croppy method will initialize croppy plugin on division tag with id image preview tag, and whole definition store into this dollar image crop variable. Under this method first we have write enable exif option set to true, by this option will enable exif orientation reading. Below this we have write viewport option, under this option we can define inner container of the croppy, and it will be the visible part of the selected image. Under this option first, we have set width with value 200, and height also set to 200, and type set to circle. 
So here we have set the height and width of the viewport, which is visible part of selected image, which is in circle format, here we can also use square format also. But here we have used circle format type. Under this option, we have set width property to 300 and height property set to 300. This is the size of outer part of cropper container. After initialize of croppy plugin on page load, now we want to display selected image under this uploaded image division tag. So here we have write dollar with file tag ID upload image with change event so when we have select image from local computer then this code will execute under this first we have write reader variable is equal to new file reader class this is for capture the file information below this we have write reader dot onload method is equal to function with event argument so when we have select image, then this class will load for capture file information. Under this, we have write dollar image crop variable dot croppy method with bind method. This is for bind an image to croppy plugin, and it will load image and croppy has been initialized on image. Under this bind method, we have write URL option set to event.target.result, it will get image URL. If image URL has been get, then it will call this then callback function, and under this function we have write console.log with this message. Now here we have write reader dot read as data URL, and under this we have write this dot files zero index. This method is used to read the contents of selected file. This way we can display selected image on uploaded image division tag, with initialization of croppy plugin on that image. Now for upload crop image. Here we have write dollar with button class crop image with click event and callback function. So when we have click on button, this code will execute. Under this first, we have write dollar image crop variable with croppy method, and under this we have write result method. By using this method we can get crop image. Under this method, we have write type option set to canvas. This option define the type of crop image, which will be canvas which we have set. In second option we have write size, and here we have write viewport. Here we have defined the size of cropped image, which will be size of viewport. Now we have write, then callback function. This function will return cropped image, which can be fetched from this function response argument. Under this function, first we have write underscore token variable is equal to dollar with input field name attribute is equal to token with value method this method will fetch value from this hidden underscore token variable and store under this variable after this we have start write ajax request for upload cropped image by using php script so in ajax we have first write URL option, and here we have write Laravel expression. Between this, we have write root method, and under this we have write image crop.upload, 
it will send request to upload method of this image crop controller. In second option, we have write type for send data to the server, so here we have use post type for send data to the server. In third option, we have write data option, and here we have write image variable with value as response variable and underscore token variable value. In fourth option, we have write data type and here we have write JSON, so it will receive data in JSON format. Lastly we have write success callback function, and this function will be called if request completed successfully, and this function will receive data from server. Under this function, we have write crop image variable is equal to, image tag with source is equal to, data.path, it will display crop image. For display crop image in uploaded image tag, here we have write, dollar with division tag uploaded image, with HTML method, and under this we have write crop image variable. So here our jQuery code is ready, now we have go to image crop controller, and here we have make upload method, with request argument. Under this method, we have write if statement, and under condition we have write dollar request with ajax method, if this method has received ajax request, then it will execute if block of code. Under this block, we have write dollar image data variable is equal to, dollar request variable with image variable. Here in this code, it will receive cropped image in base64 encoded format, and here we have store into dollar image data variable. Now here we have write, dollar image array1 is equal to explode function2 argument, like semicolon and dollar image data variable. This code will make an array from string, by using this explode function, and store into this dollar image array one variable. After this, we have again write dollar image array two variable is equal to explode function with two argument like comma and dollar image array one variable with one index. Here in dollar image array one variable with one index, we have store string with start from base 64 comma because above we have convert string to array by using explode function with semicolon as string delimiter. Now we have write dollar data variable is equal to base64 decode function, and under this we have write dollar image array2 variable with one index. Under this variable we have store only string without semicolon and comma, and this function will decodes data and code with MIME base64. Below this we have write dollar image name variable is equal to time function with PNG extension. This code will generate new unique name and store into this dollar image name variable. After this, we have write upload path variable is equal to public path function, and under this we have write crop image folder name, slash dollar image name variable. This function, will return public folder name, and under that folder we have make crop image folder, so it will give path of crop image folder name. Now we have write file put contents function with two argument, in file name argument, we have write dollar upload path variable, and in data argument we have write dollar data variable. 
This function will write a string, which we have store in dollar data variable and make file which we have specified under dollar image name variable. In short it will upload cropped image under crop image folder, now we want to send output to Ajax request. For this here we have write return statement, with response method, with JSON method, this method will send response to Ajax request in JSON format. So, here our code is ready, now we want to set root of this controller method, for this, we have open roots folder web.php file. Under this file, we have write root class with get method, with two argument, in first argument, we have write image crop. And in second argument, we have write image crop controller at the rate index, so it will called index method. For set root of upload method, here we have write root class, with post method, and in first argument, we have write image crop slash upload. And in second argument, we have write image controller at the rate upload, so it will called method. And for Ajax root method, here we have write name method, and under this we have write image crop dot upload. So here our code is ready, we have check output in browser. Friends, here we can see, we have enter base URL slash, image crop, then we can see file tag, with crop, and upload button on web page. So here when we have select image, and after selecting of image, here we can see selected image preview on left side, with initialization of croppy plugin. Here we can zoom image also, and here on image visible part of image is a viewport, we can crop image under this specified size. Here we can see upload and crop button. By clicking on this button, we can crop and upload image, so here we have click on this button, after click on crop and upload button, image has been cropped, upload in folder, and that cropped image has been visible on web page on right side. Now we have open image in new tab, so here image has been cropped, and uploaded into image crop folder. So this way, we can crop and upload image by using Croppy plugin in Laravel 6 framework. By using this Croppy plugin with Laravel 6 framework and Ajax, we can crop selected image, and upload by using Ajax without refresh of web page. And this type of feature mainly required, when you have upload image for profile. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box, or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends, or even you can also share on social media also.